Utah Governor Spencer Cox weighing in today on those layoffs just announced at Qualtrics. And the Provo-based software company says that it's cutting roughly 780 jobs. Our Daniel Woodruff is joining us live at the Capitol. And Daniel, what is the governor saying about this? Well, he says it's obviously tough news, but that it comes at an otherwise good time economically for the state of Utah. In a statement today, Governor Spencer Cox told me in part, layoffs and fluctuations in the market are so difficult for those affected, and my heart goes out to those who find themselves on the receiving end of bad news. Fortunately, there's never been a better time to look for work in Utah, where we currently have a 2.5% unemployment rate and 75,000 open jobs. Now, the Qualtrics CEO today broke the news of the layoffs in a memo to employees. He said the company hired quickly to grow, but that it's no longer sustainable for the future. The CEO promised affected employees will receive severance pay, benefits, and help finding new jobs. I talked today to an economist who said it's common to see rapid growth and then a pullback in the tech industry. During the pandemic, you did see massive hiring by tech companies across the board uh, as we were all working from home and doing all these other things. Now the economy is kind of adjusting back to a more normal situation. In his statement, Governor Cox said there are about 75,000 open jobs in Utah and plenty of state resources to help. Also, I just heard from Silicon Slopes, the organization based at the point of the mountain, the director there telling me that they plan to help any of the workers at Qualtrics who need it to get connected with other tech companies that are currently hiring. Live at the Capitol, Daniel Woodruff, KUTV 2 News.